Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to use System Restore if you can't actually boot into the Windows operating system. This should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So the first thing I would actually suggest is if you can do a hard power off three times in a row. So basically just push your computer power button in and let your computer turn on for a couple seconds and then just do a power off. So just press the button again to do a hard power off. So again, just using your computer's power button, turn it on and off three times. Some people just don't seem to follow that direction even though it's pretty straightforward. And if you guys need to further assistance on that, just look up hard power to reset online. That should explain to you guys how to actually go about uh, getting to that. So that does not get you to the automatic repair options that we will be using to run the system restore. You can alternatively go onto Microsoft's website and download the Windows 10 Media Creation Tool in which I will have a link in the description of the video and that will give you the ability to download it as an ISO and then boot your computer from the CD or USB. I've made tutorials of like that on my channel before so you're welcome to check that out. So assuming you already have the media on a CD or USB flash drive or you've automatically booted into the automatic repair setup, I'm going to assume that I'm going to be booting from my CD. So I'm going to just scroll down here using my arrow keys. I'm going to select the CD-ROM drive. I'm going to hit enter. You guys might be booting off of your USB flash drive or you might not even need to go into that screen I just showed you. Again, really depends on exactly how you got to this process. And now once you're on the Windows Setup screen, you just want to left click on Next. And then left click on this button that says Repair Your Computer at the bottom of this window. So to give it a second, underneath Choose an Option, I'm going to select Troubleshoot, Reset Your PC, or see Advanced Options. Left click on that. And then I'm going to select System Restore. Use the Restore Point Recorder on your PC to restore Windows. So I'm going to left click on that. So choose your Operating System. So I'm going to select that as well. So restore system files and settings. System restore can help fix problems that might be making your computer run slowly or stop responding. System restore does not affect any of your documents, pictures, or other personal data. Recently installed programs and drivers might be uninstalled. Left click on next. You see I have my system restore point saved in here. And then I'm going to left click on next. So it should say once started, System Restore cannot be interrupted. Do you want to continue? System Restore cannot be undone until after it has completed. If System Restore is being run in safe mode or from System Recovery Options menu, it cannot be undone. Left click on Yes. And this will take a few minutes to run, so please be patient.
All right, guys, System Restore has completed successfully. The system has been restored. Your documents have not been affected. Click Restart button to restart the computer. Just going to click on Restart here. All right, looks like we have completed. I hope this tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.